Hey everybody, how are you? I hope you're doing great. Today I'm going to show you another Hello Kitty print and it's My Melody. And this is a very cute design. I think all Hello Kitty friends are adorable. <laughs> but um, yeah, and it's easy. It's easy. Look at this. This is a representation of My Melody. The size is really cool. Look, it's kind of the size, you know, from the elbow all the way to the end of my finger. So um, it's easy. It's just, you know, the techniques using quick links. If you don't have quick links, you can try with a five inch round white and then using the racing beam technique. But the, the idea of using quick link is that it's much faster. Yes, and look at that, a about belly. I love that. So for me, the front is the cutest, the best. You can always add more details, like what, for example, where you can add a flower. And I think it had a flower right here. So you can put a flower with markers. It's a white flower. Or you just add a sticker or make a flower uh, with a five, uh, 160 balloons, you know, white and then yellow in the center. But it's optional. Just like this, I think it's going to look a cute design as my melody. If you don't have time, this is the, the awesome part. This can be as a bracelet. Yeah, pretty much. You just keep it as a bracelet, the head. Okay, when you think about fast, just the body is just gonna be an idea, and it's kind of the same type of body that I did for Elmo and for Cookie Monster that they look adorable with Dosh Big Belly. So let's start and make it, and, and then you will see. I'm gonna start with the head, but again, if you just make the head and all the pink, it will be only two balloons. So my melody can be made out with only two balloons, a quick link white and a 260 pink kind of okay and then if you want something more elaborated you use another quick link white and a 260 white so this design is a four balloon design entire the whole thing okay let's start it uh, the trick is all about the quick links and how much air you should put and to make it easy oh man these balloons are broken and this is something i noticed in what is decomex sometimes they came with holes and it's a bummer because they are good you know the size is great and the price is even better. <laughs> but uh, they sometimes have these holes, I think are getting too old. Eh, I don't know. Okay, so you inflate your balloon, like the palm of your hand, all this, all your hand, I think. Okay, lose some air and then tie it. When it's a little bit bigger than the palm of your hand, you tie it close to the nozzle. So this is gonna create the same technique that I use for kitty cats, for cheetahs, for tigers, cats, you know? It's kind of the same idea. You have this and then you squish the air. This technique I use it a lot, so this is something fun. You split it in half pretty much when you're here, like a hand and a hand or four or five finger long, five finger long, half. And then you just twist and tie it here, okay? Yep, that's it. You just tie it. Awesome. So you have here also a tip and a connection there. That's the idea. Now this, if you're gonna make the whole body, you can go ahead and repeat because it's gonna be the same idea for the belly, for the, for the bottom, okay? Then you inflate it all the way, just to stretch the balloon, loose the air until it fits a little bit bigger than the palm of your hand. Then you tie it close to the nozzle, you squish, you split it in half, and then you just tie these two sides together. Okay, there we go. Now you have this. Now, this is the way I did it because I think it's kind of easy and fast. You, you tie these two together. Yep, you just tie it together, pass it around, and tie it. Yes, that's it. Double. It's all wiggling. It's okay. It's going to be connections in here to make things more stable. These chubby things are in the front, in the back, these parts. Okay, now I'm going to go with the 260 pink. In order to recreate the ears, it's kind of like a cute cape or hat. So you're going to inflate it like living, let me see. I guess it's six, seven finger tail. And I'm going to make like two or three finger loop. Lock, another two or three finger loop. Twist. Then a... Uh, like a one finger bubble pinch twist and another one finger bubble pinch twist. It's kind of like the idea of a bow tie, okay? So you're gonna have it like this. 
and that is gonna be kind of like here attach so now you it's I think it's easy when you make the whole thing and then you just introduce this and kind of like wrap around sometimes that is easy but it's up to you how you feel you know it's better so for me it's something like this that's it and then I put things in proper position um, you know it's good also trying an experiment what is easy for you but that you have to end up uh, with something like this I'm gonna show you something like this let me see okay that's the front now from here you're gonna just go around just go around and that's it pass it around and go back okay that's just like this now pass it around and then cut leave all this don't get rid of this just tie it because all that are gonna become ears that's the idea whatever is left over is gonna be the ears on top so you can um pass this around a couple of times to lock everything around and then put it in proper position the way you prefer okay that's what i'm doing just looking at the side and play with that again these designs are easy and they are cute and they are means you can make it fast with practice now the leftover you just kind of squish stretch so this as long as possible kind of split it in half i think that's going to be easier twist and one piece is going to go look at this technique here you're going to open you know and kind of pass it through what yes it pass it through yes you will see i'm going to show you there pass it through there okay so just grab it and if things get and twist like this part get and twist it's okay it's just a reference to know where it's kind of a half okay and then when you are kind of in the middle you just push it up okay and look you have something like this now from here you can just grab and bend i think it's kind of like the right side right this is the right side or this side that i'm doing i bend it a little bit at the end you know and the other one cannot go the other side so you can play with that and things doesn't have to be perfect just something you know it's a little detail bend it but that's it pretty much sometimes it's all you know open but you can always grab this and then it's pinch and twist and then lose here you know so that's gonna help the bending part okay so it's optional yes but grab this cut the end and look we have if you're in the hybrid again oh avoid this part of white just keep it as a bracelet and so um maybe you will need a second balloon to make more loops maybe now let's go with that 260 white and it's this um doesn't have to be you know this one i'm using any brand this doesn't it's not any you know fancy brand whatever so it's gonna work so i'm gonna start again the feet simple no more than three finger loop twist 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 lock and inflated seven finger tails gonna be fine or six twist 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 another one is the feet two finger bubble pinch twist and that's it then just this is what it's remember in other designs we just cut here and attach it with a quick link or with a top or leave a tip yes but also this is another way because in some of the pictures i've seen it that it have a little bit longer legs so that's why i'm gonna do it this way pass it again in between you know the quick link how we did for the head and the ears kind of the same idea pass it in between nice and gentle measure something like a hand here and then just kind of like you are in the middle look from this kind of um two bubbles okay so you have it like this and then bend here until you find out the same size so play with how long you want the legs okay it's just how i seen it in the picture as a reference but cut then here you can lose some air but you don't need you need this for the arms now you grab this pass it around tie it and tie them with the other side just in case why not and then put things in proper position 
and I'm gonna show you how things are looking so far. We can always accommodate things, because, but look, okay? Now from here, uh, you're going to, uh, in the back it looks longer the legs, you see? But because you have a belly, the legs look not that long. Actually perfect size, I think. Now you're gonna grab something like four finger long, twist, 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 and then pass it in between here. Just squish, pass it around. And that's what I'm doing. So, and this is kind of the way I interpret it and kind of like finding and using the quick lick balloons, you can make a very cute design. Make sure again, another four finger long, and loose the end and tighten. There we go. Really, it's not that hard. I'm sorry guys, my son is practicing. He's jamming with his friends. Uh, so now you cut the excess, okay? It's like, I hope I don't get that. That cookie, the cookie copy, you know that. Okay, now you have this, then it's gonna be shoppy time, okay? So, let's see. Shoppy time. So now let's go with shoppy time that is super easy. It's gonna be big eyes. I think she have big eyes, but it's separated, kind of like from the middle. Kind of big eyes like this. So from the middle of this part, you just kind of put situate the eyes and then also the nose. And I think she has a mouth. Like Hello Kitty doesn't have a mouth, she have a cute mouth there. So from here, what else? What else from here? Yellow. We're gonna get yellow for the nose. So just color it. And if you want, I don't know, the picture I saw, it doesn't have cheeks, but I think these designs always look cute with cheeks. If it's not, it's okay like this. Now let's see how we look if I make a flower. I'm gonna use white, black as a, you know, kind of make a flower, you know, and then I'm gonna color it, the color that it's supposed to be. Look, a flower there. And then I'm gonna just see if my yellow is gonna work, work there. You probably know, but a little bit. It's maybe nothing, you know, but I just wanna show you that you can have stickers with flowers. I do have a sticker with flowers. You can even add there if you want a butterfly, I guess, but I think the original have a, this type of flower. Grab white and kind of color it. You can make this also as a regular little flower, making all the petals with pinch twist white, 160 white, it is possible. But sometimes it's easier that way. So this is kind of the idea. Look, I put it to, to the side, but people are gonna be able to see there is a flower, maybe this angle. Tell me in the comments, what do you think? If you like the design, don't forget, like, comment, subscribe. I hope you can hear me because my son is playing. Um, and check out because this design and many other Hello Kitty friends are in a playlist that says Hello Kitty and Friends and you will see these and all the cute designs from Hello Kitty uh, thank you so much for watching my videos don't forget like, comment, subscribe and below in the description of all my videos there are ideas how to collaborate with this channel you can donate money to my Venmo PayPal account because everything even a dollar from dollar to dollar I'm gonna be able to save money I think it would be awesome to get a computer yes it's a big goal but I don't think it's impossible and that's gonna help this channel for sure to be better why because I'm gonna be able to have an, another screen not just myself on filming my plan is now have you know like a tablet or you know something like a laptop that I can see designs and so then I can create a podcast something like we can be talking while twisting balloons, while looking about, you know, theory, ideas, techniques, and do it at the moments, live videos for whoever is there at that moment, or even for myself, you know, making videos, and at that moment I wanna tell you something, it's easier for me to connect with the internet and tell you, you know, to make videos better, I think, huh? But that would be awesome. Uh, www.blingblingjam.com is the awesome website for, uh, what is? The balloon convention I'm gonna be on July 2024. And I invite in everybody because that will be the best moments to meet each other. All of us here, instead of being on YouTube, watching videos, we can all jam in person. So that will be the only really opportunity because that's the only convention I go. 
you know it's not that i can make it for all the conventions that exist for balloons balloon conventions there's lots but i choose las vegas Bling jam and that's the one i'm gonna be also on july 2024 so if you can make it that's gonna be awesome Okay, dokie, okay. I'll see you in the next video. Stay tuned because it's coming another friend of Hello Kitty. And it's very easy. And I think it's going to be pretty much similar to this one. That's why it's coming next to this tutorial. I don't remember the name because it looks like a vampire. But it's a Hello Kitty vampire, something like that. And it's going to be perfect for Halloween, maybe. So that's it. Bye bye. Oh, one more thing. <laughs> don't forget to tag me. Tag me when you make something that you did because you watch these videos, tag me on social media, Facebook, Instagram, not even in the mentions, you know, you can, you don't have to mention me, but you can in the comments tag me as at Alpaca Global, or even send me pictures of the things that you made because you watch this YouTube channel, you know, like designs you learn by watching this YouTube channel, like this, for example, you made it, take a picture and send it to my email. That is alpaca global at gmail that way you can see that you made it and also i can share it at the end of my video so stay tuned because always at the end of my videos i like to share pictures of your designs the things that you did because you watch these tutorials that's it now i'm leaving bye bye <laughs>